Your body is exhausted, your mind can't calm down, and your jaw is carrying the weight of all the stress in your life. If you wake up in the morning and your jaw hurts, this isn't just jaw pain. Your body is sending you a serious warning. Hi everybody, I'm Dr. Marinaz, the dentist, and today I want to talk about a habit that's very often ignored, but over time, it can damage your teeth. It's called teeth grinding, also known as bruxism. Teeth grinding means rubbing your teeth against each other. This can happen during the day, for example, when you're in traffic, when you're angry, or even when you're stressed, or completely unconsciously at night while you're asleep. Most of the time, the person has absolutely no idea they're doing it. What's interesting is that teeth grinding is not just a mechanical habit. It's often a direct reflection of an overactive nervous system. That means your body stays stuck in fight or flight mode even while you're sleeping. Your brain thinks there is danger and the jaw muscles are one of the first places where this tension gets stored. When I examine my patient teeth, the signs are very clear. Severe and malware, micro cracks, jaw muscle pain, and sometimes even fractured teeth or broken crowns. The force applied to the teeth during grinding can reach up to 250 pounds per tooth. That's several times higher than normal chewing force. A tooth that was designed for eating is now carrying the weight of life stress. If you wake up with jaw pain or your facial muscles feel tired in the morning, that means you're grinding your teeth. This can lead to chronic jaw pain, tension, headaches, and even temporomandibular joint disorder. The joint that connects your jaw to your skull is here. When the muscles around it are constantly over-contracted, it causes pain and limited movement. So what is the main cause? In one word, stress. Now what does this constant pressure do to your teeth? One of the most important damages is something called abfraction. Abfraction is a lesion that usually appears as a V-shaped notch near the gum line, where the tooth meets the gum. Many patients think it's a cavity or the result of brushing incorrectly, but the truth is abfraction is much more of a biomechanical problem than a hygiene issue. From a biomechanical point of view, teeth grinding creates forces that teeth were never designed to tolerate. When these forces repeat over and over, the tooth develops a structural fatigue. In this situation, the tooth begins to bend microscopically. The highest stress concentrates right at the cervical area of the tooth, where the enamel is thinner. Over the time, this stress causes the tooth structure to break down, and the classic abfraction notch forms. Not because of decay, not because of acid, but because of the pressure. The other side, teeth grinding can also cause dental treatments to fail. Feelings that keep falling out, crowns that crack, implants that start hurting too soon. Very often, these are signs of a hidden destructive force. Even the best dental treatments won't last because excessive force is constantly being applied. The scary part is that that fraction usually starts without pain. You might only notice sensitivity to cold or during brushing. Because the pain isn't severe, it gets ignored. But over time, the notch gets deeper, the dentin becomes exposed, and the tooth becomes extremely sensitive and vulnerable. Many times, x-rays don't show any obvious decay, but the patient has pain and sensitivity. That's when a fraction diagnosed. In advanced cases, the pulp can even become involved leading to the need for root canal treatment, meaning a tooth that was completely intact and healthy with no cavities at all ended up needing root canal therapy because of excessive force. So what is the solution? If you grind your teeth during the day, you need to consciously stop the habit. Chew sugar for your gum, but do not grind your teeth together. Take short breaks, listen to music, or write down your feelings several times a day. Ask yourself, is my jaw tense right now? And if the answer is yes, take a deep breath and relax. Meditation or deep breathing, even just five minutes a day, can reduce stress levels. The reality is you need to calm yourself down because now you're aware that this habit is damaging your teeth and you need to let it go. If teeth grinding happens during sleep and it's unconscious, using a nut guard is essential. A custom made appliance made by your dentist that you wear at night to prevent your teeth from directly contacting each other. Remember, no treatment can replace lifestyle changes and stress reduction. Adequate sleep, balanced nutrition, enough water, all of these directly affect jaw and dental health. 
Dental care doesn't only happen in dental offices, it starts at home. Finally, regular dental visits play a crucial preventive role. Many lesions like abfraction, micro cracks, and early wear can be detected and controlled in their early stages with a careful examination. Early treatment not only costs less but also prevents irreversible damage. We need to understand that teeth grinding is a message from an exhausted body, a body that has been under tremendous pressure and hasn't found a healthy way to release tension. Taking care of your teeth is not just about brushing. Taking care of your mind is also part of it because the mouth isn't just part of your body. The mouth is the mirror of your body.